Hi guys, happy Sunday and welcome back to my channel, Couponing with Kayla. So we are outside of CVS. We're about to head in here and check out some deals. I'm gonna walk you through the deals in the store. Plus I'll have a printable list below the video. So print that out, take it to the store with you. It's gonna help make your shopping trip super easy. And if you are completely new to my channel, welcome. Thank you so much for being here. And if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up as well as hit the red subscribe button below and the notification bell so you don't miss any new ones. Now, I just finished up over at Walgreens, so if you're a Walgreens shopper, definitely check out that video because I got some really good deals. Hopefully, we can get some really good deals in CVS as well. I want to take a second to say thank you all so, so much for sending birthday wishes for Axel this past week, birthday cards, birthday comments. It is so appreciated, you guys. And if you didn't see the video that I posted where he's opening all of his cards, he was like ecstatic. He was so, so, so excited. So thank you all so much again. Uh, we had his birthday party yesterday, his cowboy birthday party, and it was it was a hit. He really enjoyed it. So I'll have that up over on At Home with Kayla on Monday morning so you, can, you guys can see how his party went and also the party prep and all of that. So anyways, guys, we're gonna head in the store. We are gonna pick up some deals. So let me know in the comments below if you got some good coupons to work with. Let me know what your plans are this week. Have you got anything fun planned? Maybe you did something super exciting this weekend. Let me know. I love to hear it. We're going to go ahead and check out these deals. <laughs> All right guys, so we are getting started and check it out. Christmas clearance is at 90% off, so make sure you check your store. All right guys, so we got lots of 90% off clearance, so I'm gonna show you lots of these games are part of it. $1.25, normally $12.49. So we've got Hungry Hippo, we've got Trouble. Look at that, $1.25. We've got Monopoly. Um, connect for all of these are part of that um, we've also got these little elf pet blind bags that I showed you guys last week they are now 60 cents normally at $5.95 um, little sprinkles 62 cents so next little gift bags 50 cents these little lights battery operated a dollar 20 so so many good finds i think i'm gonna grab this wrapping paper for my mom she loves metallic wrapping paper so should be about 49 cents yep 50 cents i'm gonna grab that for her so i just found these right here for 11.79 but they look like advent calendars so i'm just gonna scan them and see if they're part of 90 percent off they may or may not be but it's worth trying all right, you guys, so I got like a cart full of stuff for the 90% off, those two frozen lip smackers, even though they were bringing up regular price, she said the cheapest she could do them for was 75%. So I was fine with that because it still made them like two something each and it's lip smackers, which is normally not that cheap. So I'm gonna put this in the cart and then we're gonna go back and actually do our deals. All right, guys, so we got a few different options for the Spin 30 Get a $10 Extra Buck deal this week. So we've got Tide Pods, $12.99. We have a $3 digital coupon for those. Um, if you like Gain products, we do have the Gain Liquid for $6.99. There's a $1 digital coupon on the app, so that's an option. Um, there's also the Fabric Softener. So the fabric softener is also $6.99 and we have a $1 digital for that. So lots of good options. Now I personally am going to go with some paper products today. So let me show you what I'm going to grab. Um, over here we have the bounty paper towels. They're $8.99 and we have a $1 digital. We also have a $1 digital for the Charmin that is $8.99. So I'm going to go ahead and pick these up as well as the Tide. All right, so all of these items right here total me $30.97. We are gonna use a $3 digital for Tide, a dollar for Charmin, and a dollar for Bounty, all digital coupons. We're gonna pay $25.97. You can pay with extra bucks to lower that out-of-pocket cost. Earn a $10 extra buck back, making it $15.97 for all three of these. And that's the 35 count of the Tide. And then we've got six equals 24 rolls on the mega rolls of the Charmin. And we've also got the four equals six for the Bounty. 
Next up, I'm going to grab the Garnier Fruities. They're two for $8. Get a $3 extra buck, so make it $5 for two. But I have this $3 coupon. It is expired, but normally CVS will take coupons up to like 15 days expired, maybe more. So I'm going to use this. After using this coupon, plus we have a $1 digital coupon that we got for Garnier this week. That is going to take off $4. We're going to pay $4, get a $3 extra buck, making it $1 for both. So let me know if you have that coupon and if you end up doing this deal. Next up, I have a couple of options for the Dove Shampoo. They're two for nine. Get a $2 extra buck when you buy two. We have a $4 coupon that came in our Unilever insert. So I'm going to use this. Pay $5, get $2 back. Makes it two for $3, which is good for some Dove Shampoo. But there also is another scenario that we can do for this if you have a 3 off 15 CRT. So I'll show that to you here in just a second. So if you have that 3 off of 15 hair care CRT for Dove, go ahead and grab four of these. We're going to use two of these $4 coupons. These are a limit of two. Then we're going to use that 3 of 15 CRT as well as a $1 digital coupon that may glitch with this. So we're going to pay $6, get a $2 extra buck, make some four for $4 or just $1 each, which is an awesome deal for Dove. Next up, we're going to go ahead and do the CoverGirl deal. It's buy two, get four, or buy three, get seven. So I'm not going to do it today because I only have one of these coupons, but if you still have th two of the three off one coupons, grab two of these for $5.29 each. Your total will be $10.58. After the two $3 coupons that we got in last week's insert, you would pay $4.48, get a $4 extra buck. Makes it just $0.58 cents for both, so not bad. Next, if you want to grab some of the Hallmark cards, they are buy three and you get a $3 extra buck. Now, normally I would test this out with 99 cent cards, but I cannot find any 99 cent cards here at my store. So if they were 99 cents, you buy three, get the $3 extra buck and make them completely free. But it does say $2 and up on the sign. So technically, if you bought three cards that were $2 each, your total would be $6. Get a $3 extra buck and make them three for $3 or just $1 each. So definitely let me know if you test this deal out with the 99 cent cards or if you decide to do it with the $2 cards, you could definitely do that as well. Lots of different options. I'm going to check one more area just to see if I can find any 99 cent ones to test it out. If not, I mean, a dollar each is still not too bad. So my store has a whole section of the two for $4 cards, but still cannot find any 99 cent ones. So I don't know if they got rid of them or if I'm just not seeing them today. All right, guys, so this is everything we are picking up. We're about to head over to checkout. I got this four off of a $40 purchase CRT when I bought my Christmas clearance item. So I'm gonna use this on this transaction. So I think it's gonna be a pretty good deal. All right, guys, so I'm back in the car from CVS. The transaction went really well. Actually, one of my favorite cashiers was there. So that was really awesome. She's always really, really friendly um, to talk to while I'm checking out. So all my coupons scanned, even that one that was expired, because normally CVS will take them up to like 15 days expired. I don't normally like say like, hey, this is expired, but it normally will scan. <laughs> so anyways, all those worked. All my digitals came off, used some extra bucks, paid very little out of pocket today. So we're gonna head home, we're gonna go over the receipt, and we're gonna talk final cost of everything we picked up all right guys so i am back home and this is my cvs haul for this week you can see apollo is laying here sleeping uh, we're gonna go ahead and get into this haul really quickly so i did everything on one transaction you can see right here on my receipt all of my items and then right down here, you can see our coupons. So we had the two $4 Dove coupons. We had the $3 Fruities coupon. It did scan, no problem. Then for digitals, we had $3 off Tide Pods, a dollar off Bounty, a dollar off of Charmin. I guess I'm talking too loud for him. <laughs> we have the digital for Dove. That dollar did come off, even though I used those $4 um, paper coupons. Then we had $4 off a of $40 purchase, three off a of $15 hair care purchase for Dove, a dollar off of two on the Fruities hair care, and then I used some extra bucks to help lower my out-of-pocket. So I ended up using $28.09 in extra bucks. So my subtotal right here for nine items was $3.88. I played I paid that plus tax. So that was 94% savings right there. Okay, so with that being said, we're going to go ahead and add back in the extra bucks we used. So I used $28.09 in extra bucks. 
add that to our 388 total, that means that you would be paying around 3197 if you weren't paying with extra bucks on this. Now, we got back today, let me see here. We got back a $10 extra buck for the Spin 30 deal. We got back a $3 extra buck, and that was for the Garnier for Teeth. And then we got $2 back for the Dove deal. So with those extra bucks back, that's $15 back in extra bucks. It makes my final cost $16.97 for these nine items or about $1.88 per item, which is not terrible for some of the paper products, laundry, and the Dove hair care is not always cheap. So I'm happy with it. And like I said, I paid very little out of pocket. I love rolling those extra bucks at CVS. So let me know in the comments what you think. I also wanted to show you guys, I did not um, unload my car with all the clearance stuff yet, but I showed you guys in the store a lot of what I was getting. So you can see right here on my receipt, most of the items that I picked up, they're $1.20, 50 cents, 60 cents, um, $1.25, I got several of those games. And then on the Lip Smacker advent calendars, um, she did go ahead and give me 75% off on those because it wouldn't let her do 90%, but she said they should have been part of the markdowns. So anyways, I paid $33.82 for tons of games and other things that are gonna be perfect for some for my kids for gifts, some for other kids, maybe to put back for like parties and things like that, and also some for donation as well. So that was a savings of $261 there, and that was 89% savings on my clearance haul. So let me know if you found some good clearance for that 90% off. Always scan things if they, you know, even remotely you possibly think that they could be part of it. You know, some may not be. I scanned these one little candles that I thought would be part of it. They weren't, but then the games were and they didn't even seem like something that would be part of it. So definitely let me know what you find. I appreciate you all so, so much for watching and I'll see you later. Bye guys.